obviously uh, the town, the city of uh, Malay in the Maldives. Uh, we're at uh, Maldives International Airport. That's how you get here uh, if you come on holiday to the Maldives. Basically only International Airport. Uh, and then from there you get the ferry to wherever you're going. You can see a seaplane taking off there. Going to one of the resorts. Yeah, from the airport there's no roads anywhere, you have to take the boat, by like that one. So the boats. Yes, welcome to Maldives Airport. Uh, it's just there, the main terminal building. It's on its, uh, it's, on its own island. Uh, the airport's on its own island. It's called Hul Hul Male. Um, just across there you've got the uh, the airport hotel. And if your flight gets in late and you don't have time to go to the resort, you can set the that's the airport hotel there. Maldives. Other than that, uh, basically I picked up in a boat. Yeah, so welcome to Maldives. Uh, I'm just waiting for my boat. We went to go to the, uh, the Taj Exotica, it's about a 15 minute boat ride. Yeah, it's all the airport there. On its own island. I'll take you inside. Yeah, there's all the jetties there for the boats. Just down there. Trans Maldivian is one of the uh, seaplane companies. So lots of the resort islands, they're like miles, 100 miles, 200 miles. It's a bit too far to take a, it's a bit too far to take a speed boat, 200 miles, right? To take a seaplane. Because all little islands dotted in the sea. Right, so we're going this way. Let's go in the airport. We're going to the airport and uh, share around all the, all the different resorts have their booths there. There's a couple of shops as well, so it's a again. There's a pedestrian crossing. So this is the arrivals hall. Yeah, there is one at the arrivals hall. Yeah, you can go well submarine. Been on that. This takes you about 30 meters underground. Look at all the sea life. It's one of the tourist attractions. Yeah, reason when the arrivals hall that are where uh, between resorts here. So we're waiting for an Air India plane from Bangalore that touched down about 20 minutes ago. So the Taj are to go again. They're going to take us and the people that get off the Air India plane to the resort at the same time. So uh, they said, uh, come to the airport and we'll meet you here. The Four Seasons brought us here. We're just waiting for the plane. Yeah, the arrivals hall. I'll show you where people come from here. Yeah, that's that Bangalore plane, A1265, landed, quarter past one. It should be out soon, it's 20 minutes after it landed. All the resorts are here. All their booths. Whichever hotel you're staying at, so that's Anantara. Barros, Sun Ocean. Lily Beach Resort and Spa, Coco Island. The one that we're going to, uh, it's my bag, it's fairly safe. I think the Maldives has the lowest murder rate in the world. I don't think anybody's ever got murdered here. It's in the Guinness Book of Records. That's where we're going. Taj Exotica Resort and Spa. I've said it at the event before, but that's where we're going. There's some bags there. Lux is a good one. There's a Lux Hotel on Rodeo Drive. It's Banyan Tree. Good hotel is. Yeah, Banyan Tree. Yeah, all the resorts. Some of the good ones uh, they have booths as well. Uh, Four Seasons have a booth. 
Jamira have one, and Antara have one. Yeah, yeah. So that's the Four Seasons booth. So when you get you just sit there and uh, get free coffee and anything, you know, sandwiches and stuff. And Antara have one. It's like a lounge basically. Some shops. Yeah, and Antara. Jumeirah. Got a couple of hotels as well, Jumeirah. Yeah, so they have their boots, you can just sit there like a lounge. Rather than what I'm doing, walking around. Yeah, all the boots. Yeah, departures is through there. It says departures. It's tomorrow night for me. Enjoy it till then. There's a couple of restaurants and stuff here. Svensson's. Coffee Club Burger King. Thai Express. Right, back to where we started. It's back to where we started. It's a uh, circumnavigation of uh, Malay International Airport, Maldives. There you go, that's our boat. Taj Exotica Resort and Spa. It's about 15, 20 minutes. That's our boat. That's quite coincidental, actually. I didn't know it would be there. There you go, Taj Exotica Resort and Spa. It's got the flag on it. Yeah, waiting for those people from uh, Bangalore to get off the plane. Clear customs. It's Mali. All right, bye. Ah, share around all the all the different resorts have their booths there. It's a couple of shops as well, so it's kind of again. There's a pedestrian crossing. So this is the arrivals hall. Yeah, there is one with the arrivals hall. Yeah, you can go well submarine. You know that. This takes you about 30 meters underground. Look at all the sea life. It's one of the tourist attractions. Yeah, the reason we're in the arrivals hall is so that we're uh, between resorts here. So we're waiting for an Air India plane from Bangalore that touched down about 20 minutes ago. So the Taj Exotic where we're going, they're going to take us and the people that get off the Air India plane to the resort at the same time. So uh, they said, uh, come to the airport and we'll meet you here. The Four Seasons brought us here. We'll just wait for the plane. Yeah, the arrivals hall. I'll show you where people come from here. Yeah, the town, the city of uh, Male in the Maldives. Uh, we're at uh, Maldives International Airport. That's how you get here uh, if you come on holiday to the Maldives. Basically, the only international airport. Uh, then from there, you get the ferry to wherever you're going. See a seaplane taking off there. Going to one of the resorts. Yeah, from the airport there's no roads anywhere, you have to take the boat, like that one. So the boats. Yeah, so welcome to Maldives Airport. Uh, it's just through there, the main terminal building. It's on its, uh, it's on its own island. Uh, the airport's on its own island. It's called Hul Hul Male. Um, just across there, you've got the uh, the airport hotel. 
And if your flight gets in late and you don't have time to go. Yeah, that's that Bangalore plane, A1265, landed, quarter past one. It should be out soon, it's 20 minutes after it landed. All the resorts are here. All their booths. Chewe Hotel is staying next to this. Anantara. Barros. Sun Ocean. Lily Beach Resort and Spa. Cocoa Island. The one that we're going to, uh, it's my bags, it's fairly safe. I think the Maldives has the lowest murder rate in the world. I think anybody's ever got murdered here. So they can just book a record. That's where we're going. Taj Exotica Resort and Spa. I've said it at the event before, but that's where we're going. There's some bags there. Lux is a good one. There's a Lux Hotel on Rodeo Drive. It's Banyan Tree. Good hotel is. Yeah, all the resorts. Some of the good ones uh, they have booths as well. Uh, Four Seasons have a booth. Jumeira have one, Anantara have one, I'll show you. That's the Four Seasons booth. So when you get here, you just sit there and uh, get free coffee and anything, you know, sandwiches and stuff. And Antara have one. It's like a lounge, basically. Some shops. Yeah, and Antara. It's the resort you can set there. It's the airport hotel there, eh? Maldives. Other than that, uh, basically I picked up in a boat. Yeah, so welcome to Maldives. Uh, I'm just waiting for my boat. We're going to go to the, uh, the Taj Exotica. It's about a 15 minute boat ride. Yeah, it's all the airport there. On its own island. I'll take you inside. Yeah, there's all the jetties there for the boats. Just down there. Transmaldivian is one of the uh, seaplane companies. So lots of the resort islands, they're like 50 miles, 100 miles, 200 miles. It's a bit too far to take a... It's a bit too far to take a speedboat, 200 miles, right? To take a seaplane. Because all little islands dotted in the sea. Right, so we're going this way. Going to the airport. Going to the airport and 